This is Time Spy running on a three gigahertz Intel Core i7 uh, 5960X with 32 gigs of RAM and a pair of NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1080 Ti's running in SLI, which actually, if you look up at the upper left-hand corner, that D3D12 AFR, that's, for those of you who don't know what that is, that's, uh, that's alternate frame rendering. I didn't even realize it showed that, but that's, I mean, it's AFR. There's nothing else that could be. That's, so that's uh, alternate frame rendering is what the, uh, the SLI, uh, the 1080 Ti's are doing. Um, so normally I prefer Firestrike because Firestrike, uh, it, because it's older, I can, I can use it on, on my older builds and my high-end builds, and it scales, so it lets me compare my low-end to my high-end more effectively when I'm doing builds, but uh, I, think, uh, I think most people are going to be more interested in Time Spy on this particular setup. I'll probably run Firestrike as well, but initially we're just doing, we're just doing Time Spy. Um, this is whatever the generic version of Time Spy is. Uh, I haven't done ultra or, or, you know, whatever, 4K, 1440. I don't know what the default is, but this is the standard default variant of Time Spy. So, um, but we will let it run and give us the score. And uh, I may have a few more thoughts once it does.
Okay, so let's see. Did I beat? Ah, oh, I never beat it. <clears throat> it's always below. I think I've seen one time where the score that I got was above the average. What do you mean the average? Like, is that average for, for 1080 Ti SLI rigs? I mean, I don't know. But uh, my, my setup's always, it's always below average. Kind of unfair. So anyway, I don't actually really have a frame of reference on this because I don't normally run Time Spy, so I can't really, I can't really comment on it. But that's for those of you that are curious and uh, you were able to see the data while the run was going. So anyway, I hope you guys found this interesting and thanks for watching the video.